this took me like, because it's Bluetooth and it's like not optimized technology. It's not like cutting edge, all right? I don't, I don't know that I would recommend it yet. Uh, so it took me fucking like an hour to even hook the damn thing up. But check this out. I imagine I'm standing up back there. Okay, hold on. Maybe I can stand up. We'll see how long this cord is. Alright, imagine this, imagine, imagine there's epic music playing, and then uh, I can zoom in like this, and then I can do this, and then I can do that, and I can zoom in, and I can come back over here, and I can zoom out, and I can come back to here, and zoom in, and then go back over there. Isn't that cool? That's so fucking cool. <laughs> so cool, and then check this shit out, dude. Yo, let's fucking, hello.
USB cards that you can put in, but I don't know, like, are those compatible with any motherboard? Do I need a specific one for my motherboard? Can I just buy one? Thank you, Frizzy. Thank you. Thank you. We are gonna have so much fucking fun Wednesday and Friday. I'm so hype. I'm so excited. Well, like I've got two slots on the top of my PC that 
is your stream like? What does it sound like? That's Drew Mox, Peach was the key speaker last night. The king of cringe. Sweats and messy bun stream. You guys, you guys will get a sweats and messy bun stream when I'm like,
smells strong. Oh my god. <gasps> I got ink on my booby. Hold on, let me see if I can clean it.
because those are the key points for that shit.
guess you would know what that two parlor is.
Thank you.
is Jill. You guys know you're Jill. You guys know I'm not talking about you if you're a homie. Everyone else who is not a homie. I'm sick of your shit. Goodbye, Scorpio.
zooms in. Hello, can you see my pores? I got, I have a pretty good primer. You can see my epic eyeshadow though. impressions lucid yeah you should come <laughs> yeah I want to hear I want to hear uh, Beach and Mitch have a, a daddy dom voice off and we'll see which see we'll see which one's better <laughs> oh my god I'm fucking if I was a turtle I like could not be further in my shell
confidence on lock. Like, I'm just the most outgoing person in the world, but I am so fucking shy, you guys. Like, I am at surface level. Like, I'm a fucking, a Cadbury fucking egg. On the surface level, I can be like, yeah. But the second you're like, yeah, I'm like, oh shit, fuck. I, I'm fucking blushing. I, I, I crack immediately. <laughs> show everyone tonight. Okay, okay. We, last night was the roasting of Peach. Tonight will be the roasting of Mitch. <laughs> Hi, Virgo. How are you?
a week maybe you know it's eighth grade shit and he was just like talking about you know talking what you know i'm all like listen, listen i talk a big game i talk a huge game you know so we like sexting and shit as you do when you're a fucking hooligan and he's like yeah i'm gonna kiss you tomorrow and i was just like whoa i'm shy i'm shy <laughs> up and just like pull away and be like all right i have to go like just get the fuck out of there what do you mean you didn't fall asleep what are we talking about what <laughs> what yeah virgo i am i talk a lot of shit and and i i do not back it up when it come when it comes to uh uh sexual flirtatious things Were you asleep or were you not asleep? I 
dated someone online, I would probably need like at least 24 hours, if not like 48 hours of being around them before I would like feel comfortable doing shit.
and it sucks because like I like have friends that I'm hanging out with and I, I feel like all right Musa, I can be myself and they're like hey my other friend from another friend group wants to hang out too and I'm like immediately back in and then I'm just very quiet like at parties and shit where I am not familiar with everyone there I am very shy into myself yeah Mitch we're friends <laughs>
can't sleep, can you burn my ear until I fall asleep? No worries, babe. <laughs> That'd be so funny. My shyness is also why, like, Tinder and shit doesn't work for me, because it's like... It's all these hollow conversations where you don't actually get to know someone, and then, like, to actually get to know them, you'd have to, like, meet up with them, and then it's like, would you like to meet a random stranger on a, on a random Saturday afternoon and, and feel fucking anxious and want to fucking throw up and be like, oh, what's it gonna be like? What if I don't like him? What if he doesn't like me? Or her? I'm just like, nah, I'll, I'll stay inside and play games and be, and just be alone. <sighs> oh my god, Peach. I would fucking roll my eyes at you. I am not a bratty person, but I would roll my eyes at you. Sounds good, mushroom. I'd eat that. But it's like, what if, what if you don't like them? What if you don't vibe in person? What if they're weird? They could be anyone. They're a random person you met online. They could be literally anyone. <laughs> first like we just met and we're friends we're homies and then it's like like a uh, like a little spark of something and, and then and then and then it's like you don't have to be like you don't have to go through that awkwardness you know because like on tinder it, it's like there's like that added layer or like any online dating there's like that added layer of like expectations for like sex or something sexual or, or like if you just meet someone as friends, there's no expectations there. The only expectation is that maybe you will like each other as other as a human, you know? And if you don't, that's fine. But with Tinder, it's like, it's like such a rush. It's like, all right, get to know this absolute fucking stranger. Like, get to know them on a very shallow level. All right, do you want to fuck them? Yes or no? Do you want to fuck them bad enough to potentially pursue a relationship with them? Yes or no? It's like, no bueno.
saying I don't it's like I don't mind like sex is not that big of a deal to me in my mind but it's it is to me because of my past because of my trauma in my life I cannot stand like when people think they've like gotten one over on me they think they've manipulated me they think they won so like it feels impossible to have like casual sex with a guy and, and you'd be like hey i'm not looking for a relationship i just want to fuck and they're also not looking for a relationship they just want to fuck but then they think like they tricked you and manipulated you and they like they got one over on you even though it's a mutual agreement you know so it's like i don't i don't want anyone to feel like they they got anything over me you ain't got shit you know it's not it's not healthy but that is how my brain is wired i don't like anyone to think like to feel like i owe them something and i don't like if they feel like they have made me do something thank you for the follow floop and thomas they do harry they really do i love the how are you If you if you're if you are a girl and you match with a girl, nine times out of ten, that girl is not gay, and her boyfriend or husband or whoever the fuck uh, has been picking her for like a threesome or some shit for years, and she finally caved and is just looking for a fucking unicorn to come fuck her and her husband or boyfriend, and she's not actually fucking gay. She's just trying to like save her relationship. Which is so fucking frustrating. It happens all the time, J-Routes, all the fucking time. There are so many straight girls on gay Tinder. I feel that. 
I film most girls. I don't know if they wanted to. If they also uh, wanted wanted to bonk, then yeah. I think a lot of girls probably feel pressured to do so, and they don't actually want to. I savvy yo. I'm good. How are you? I did not pick my nose. What the heck? not 
magnetic, they're, they're glue. My eyelids constantly are in a state of having fucking eyelash glue in them. <laughs> I look fucking nuts. Like, on the, on the, the days after stream, there's always like black smudge around my eyes and like eyelash glue in my eyelashes. Staring contest. Okay, ready? One, two, three, go. self sometimes when I duplicate the tab I'm trying to see if there's any Omi streaming right now any uh, Omi's in the house say hey uh, hey uh, any Omi's in the house say hey uh, hey uh.
Sleep.